maximising high quality forage in a cow's diet over autumn is a tricky task and maintaining profitability is even harder. From March 2016, the Queensland DAF dairy team will commence a dairy cow feeding trial at the UQ DAF Gatton Research Facility over a three month period. You can see an aerial view of how the facility and some infrastructure that will be utilised on site to conduct the trial. Whether you're a dryland or irrigated farm, the trial will explore options for you on how high quality forages can be fed during the autumn feed gap to achieve not only high levels of milk production, but reduce feed related costs. The DAF team will be feeding six different diets in TMR and PMR feeding systems. To put things into perspective, a typical subtropical dairy farm would feed 60% forage and 40% grain and protein meals within their diets. The diets that we will feed at Gatton this autumn will feed 80 to 97% forage and as little as 3% grain and protein meal, which will be really pushing the boundaries on forage proportions in the diet and challenging the industry's reliance on purchased grains and protein meals. So you may wonder, how are we going to achieve this? We will be feeding high quality forages such as sorghum headlage, which is a great source of starch, lab lab silage and pasture, which can be grown under dry land conditions as a great source of protein, and high chopped corn, which is lower in fibre, just to name a few. But combined, these feeds can significantly reduce the amount of grain and protein meals required in diets. So follow the trial with us through our online and regular media updates as well as our open days to be held throughout each phase of the trial. Here is a list of upcoming dates to mark on your calendar. We look forward to seeing you there and stay tuned for more information. Mm -hmm.